the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord Jesus Christ, for our sake, you became like the grain of wheat that falls to the earth and dies, so that it may bear much fruit. You invited us to follow you along this path. When you told us that those who love their life lose it, and those who hate their life in this world will keep it for eternal life. We are attached to our life. We do not want to abandon it. We want to keep it all for ourselves. We want to hold on to it, not to give it away. But you go before us, showing us that it is only by giving away our life that we can save it. As we walk with you in the way of the cross, you lead us along the way of the grain of wheat, the way of fruitfulness, which leads to eternity. Grant that my way of the cross may not be just a moment of passing piety. Help all of us to accompany you with all our hearts in every step we take each day of our lives. Help us to walk the way of the cross with determination and perseverance. Amen. The first station, Jesus is condemned to death. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you because by your holy cross, you have redeemed the world. From the Gospel of John, Pilate brought Jesus out and sat down on the official judgment seat called Lithostrotos, or in Hebrew, Gabbatha. It was a day of preparation for the Passover, and the hour was about noon. Behold your king, Pilate said. Away with him, they shouted. Away with him, crucify him. Do you want me to crucify your king? asked Pilate. We have no king, the chief priest replied except the emperor. Then at last, Pilate handed Jesus over to them to be crucified. Prayer O sacred heart, O love divine, who now is seated at the right hand of the Father, be our merciful judge. For ignoring the cry of the innocent, forgive us. For suppressing the voice of our conscience, your pardon, Lord. May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word and the Spirit of grace. And may the heart of Jesus reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. The second station, Jesus carries His cross. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you. Because by your cross, you have redeemed the world. From the Gospel of Matthew. Then the soldiers of the governor took Jesus into the praetorium, and they gathered the whole battalion before him. They stripped him and put a scarlet robe on him. They made a crown of thorns and placed it on his head. They put a reed in his right hand as a scepter. They knelt before him and mocked him, Hail, King of the Jews. Then they spat on him, took the reed, and beat him on the head again and again. After they had mocked him, they stripped him of his robe and put his own clothes on him. Then they led him away to crucify him. Prayer O Sacred Heart, O Love Divine, Behold the wood of the cross on which hung the salvation of the world. Strengthen our hearts so we can deny ourselves, take up our cross, and follow you. For what does it profit us even if we gain the whole world but lose our soul. May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word and the Spirit of grace. And may the heart of Jesus reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. The third station Jesus falls the first time. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you. Because by your cross, you have redeemed the world. From the book of the prophet Isaiah. It was our diseases that he carried. It was our weaknesses that made him fall. He thought his troubles were a punishment from God. Punishment for his own sins. But he was pierced for our offenses crushed for our sins. He was beaten so we could be saved, and by His wounds we are healed. 
prayer. O sacred heart, O love divine, who fell on the earth to raise it up, God who became human, so that human may be one with God, make our hearts feel God's presence in everyone and in everything. May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word and the Spirit of grace. And may the heart of Jesus reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. The fourth station. Jesus meets His Mother. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you. Because by your cross, you have redeemed the world. The Gospel of Luke. Simeon blessed them and said to Mary, the baby's mother, This child is destined for the fall and rise of many in Israel. He will be a sign to be contradicted, so that the thoughts of many hearts may be laid bare. The sword shall pierce your very soul. Prayer O sacred heart, O love divine, that is most touching encounter, between a sorrowful mother and the man of sorrows. The sword pierced the immaculate heart. Grant us courage, like your mother, to face the trials that come our way. May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word in the spirit of grace. And may the heart of Jesus reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. The fifth station, Simon of Cyrene helps Jesus to carry his cross. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you, because by your cross you have redeemed the world. From the Gospel of Luke, as they were leading Jesus away, a man named Simon, who was from Cyrene, happened to be coming in from the field. The soldier seized him and put the cross on him and made him carry it behind Jesus. Prayer O Sacred Heart, O Love Divine, who came not to be served but to serve, yet allowed somebody to carry your cross, open our eyes and our hearts to see the needs of our neighbors and share their cross. May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word and the Spirit of grace. And may the heart of Jesus reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. The sixth station. Veronica wipes the face of Jesus. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you. Because by your cross, you have redeemed the world. A reading from the book of the prophet Isaiah. There was nothing beautiful or majestic about his face. Nothing to attract us to his appearance. He was despised and rejected. A man of sorrows, acquainted with deepest grief. We turn our backs on him and look the other way. He was despised and we did not care. Prayer O sacred heart, O love divine, whose face is the Father's mercy, make my heart restless to seek your face in the faces of my brothers and sisters, marred by poverty, injustice, and violence. May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word in the spirit of grace, and may the heart of Jesus reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. The seventh station, Jesus falls the second time. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you, because by your cross you have redeemed the world. From the Gospel of John, Amen, Amen, I say to you, Unless a grain of wheat falls to the ground and dies, 
it remains just a grain of wheat. But if it dies, it produces much fruit. Anyone who loves their life will lose it, while anyone who hates their life in this world will keep it for eternal life. Prayer O Sacred Heart, O Love Divine, You fell like a grain of wheat, so that we too may have life, life to the full. Make our selfishness and vain glory fall, and lose our greed and pride. May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word and the Spirit of grace, and may the heart of Jesus reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. The Eighth Station Jesus meets the women of Jerusalem. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you, because by your cross you have redeemed the world. From the Gospel of Luke, Jesus turned to the women and said, Daughters of Jerusalem, weep not for me, weep rather for yourselves and for your children. For behold, the days are coming when they will say, Blessed are the women who are childless, the womb that never bore, and the breasts that never nursed. At that time, people will say to the mountains, Fall upon us, and to the hills, cover us. For if they do this, when the tree is green, what will happen when it is dry? May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word and the Spirit of grace. And may the heart of Jesus reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. The Ninth Station Jesus falls the third time. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you, because by your cross you have redeemed the world. From the book of Job For there is hope for a tree, even if it is cut down. Again it shall sprout, its shoots shall not stop. If its root grows old in the earth, and in the dust its stump dies, the scent of water it will bud and form branches as a young plant. Prayer O Sacred Heart, O Love Divine, Your three falls led to your resurrection on the third day. Teach us to hope amid our many trials, and look forward to the day of our redemption. May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word and the Spirit of grace, and by the heart of Jesus reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. The Tenth Station Jesus stripped off His garments. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you, because by your cross you have redeemed the world. From the Gospel of Matthew And when they came to a place called Golgotha, which means the place of a skull, they offered Him wine to drink, mixed with gall. When He tasted it, He refused to drink it. After they crucified him, they divided his garments by casting lots. Then they sat down and kept watch over him there. Prayer O Sacred Heart, O Love Divine, you were stripped of everything but abandon yourself to the Father. Teach our hearts not to be anxious about tomorrow, but to trust that you can make all things good and wonderful. May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word and the Spirit of grace, and by the heart of Jesus reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. The Eleventh Station Jesus is nailed to the cross. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you, 
because by your cross you have redeemed the world. From the Gospel of Mark. It was the third hour when they crucified him. The inscription of the charge against him read, The King of the Jews. And with him they crucified two bandits, one on his right and one on his left. Those who passed by derided him, shaking their heads and saying, Aha, you who would destroy the temple and build it in three days, save yourself and come down from the cross. The same way, the chief priests along with scribes were also mocking him among themselves. In the same way, the chief priests along with scribes were also mocking him among themselves and saying, He saved others. He cannot save himself. Let the Messiah, the King of Israel, come down from the cross now so that we may see and believe. Those who were crucified with him also mocked him. Prayer O Sacred Heart, O Love Divine, King and Center of all hearts, may your heart reign in our hearts so we will never flee from our trials and crosses in life, but face them with hope and equanimity. May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word in the spirit of grace, and may the heart of Jesus reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. The twelfth station, Jesus dies on the cross. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you, because by your cross you have redeemed the world. From the Gospel of Mark, when the sixth hour had come, darkness covered the earth till the ninth hour. The ninth hour, Jesus cried out with a loud voice, Eloi, Eloi, lema sabachthani, my God, my God, why have you abandoned me? Then Jesus gave a loud cry and breathed his last. Prayer O Sacred Heart, O Love Divine, truly you are God's Son. Blood and water that flowed from your pierced side have washed away our sins. Remove from us our stony hearts and replace them with hearts of flesh. May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word in the spirit of grace. And may the heart of Jesus reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. The thirteenth station, Jesus is taken down from the cross and given to his mother. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you, because by your cross you have redeemed the world. From the Gospel of Mark, there were also women looking on from a distance. Among them were Mary Magdalene, and Mary the mother of James the younger, and Joseph and Salome. These used to follow him and provided for him when he was in Galilee. And there were many other women who had come with him to Jerusalem. Prayer O Sacred Heart, O Love Divine, You receive the compassion of women amidst the brutality of men. Give us a new heart and a new spirit that we can also be compassionate to our needy brothers and sisters. May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word in the spirit of grace. And by the heart of Jesus, reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. The fourteenth station. Jesus is laid to the tomb. We adore you, Christ, and we bless you, because by your cross you have redeemed the world. From the Gospel of Mark, when evening had come, 
And since it was the day of preparation, that is, the day before the Sabbath, Joseph of Arimathea, respected member of the council, was also himself waiting expectantly for the kingdom of God, went boldly to Pilate and asked for the body of Jesus. Then Pilate wondered if he were already dead, and summoning the centurion, he asked him whether he had been dead for some time. When he learned from the centurion that he was dead, he granted the body to Joseph. Then Joseph bought a linen cloth, and taking down the body, wrapped it in the linen cloth, and laid it in a tomb that had been hewn out of the rock. He then rolled the stone against the door of the tomb. Mary Magdalene and Mary the mother of Joseph saw where the body was laid. Prayer O Sacred Heart, O Love Divine, You were buried by strangers in a borrowed tomb. From this tomb, the promise of the resurrection has shone forth, like a grain of wheat buried and produced life. Make us witnesses to the world of this good news. May the darkness of sin and the night of unbelief vanish before the light of the Word in the spirit of grace. And may the heart of Jesus reign in the hearts of all. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, protect us from all harm and evil. Closing Prayer we thank you, Lord, for allowing us to follow your way of the cross. May it remind us of God's love that is stronger than death. Sacred Heart of Jesus, make our hearts like your heart. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Final blessing. The Lord be with you. And may the Almighty God bless you all, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Ching-chong!